We got uh, Tater Nader making his way through the bracket, just defeating Zenyu. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, going up now against K9. Uh, the Bowser Jr. that could, really. Uh, not the Bowser Jr. that could. The He's Windy. I'm sorry. The I'm Wendy, sorry. Who clearly is the best of all the Koopalings. Windy's Bay, of course. I mean, yes. she has to be. <laughs> all right. So Bowser Jr. definitely not considered a top tier character compared to Sheik. Uh, <laughs> Sheik should have a lot of tools in this matchup. Uh, the fair in particular in this matchup just absolutely ruins Bowser Jr. Not only that, but the Nair will make it very difficult for Bowser Jr. to get in if, he, if uh, Taylor gets a little bit too comfortable with Koopa carding in. Ooh, I knew he was going to go for that read. K9 loves to wait out those air dodge reads with the bouncing fish and takes the first stock with it here. Oh, but just picking up that Mexico and throwing right in K9's face. All right, we're going to get the Sheik String? No, not quite. The platform actually messing up K9 a little bit there. It was moving in as he wanted to fall off, and it kind of messed up his timing. Oh, those needles, too. I forgot, because the needles go high enough where they don't hit the cart, so they actually stop Bowser Jr. while Bowser Jr. is running at Sheik. Wow. It's, uh, it's unfortunate to be Bowser Jr. main in this matchup, and it's oh. kind of showing. He does have a secondary pickup, or a secondary pick character he in YouTube, right? Like oh my god. Right. Did you see the Mecha Koopa ride the win box? Yeah. Uh, that was amazing. Well, you can just <laughs> file that under a Smash 4 thing. Yeah. Sakurai, get me off this wild ride. <laughs> well, let's see if we do see a character switch from Tater Nader. I would not be surprised. That was uh, uh I know that he's picking up new two for matchups like these, but he's been on a tear with his Koopa Link. I mean, he, yeah, he just beat Zenyu. Like, what the heck? So it's, I, I mean... Would not be surprised if he switches to, you know, a higher tier character. But at the same time, so you got to go with what your gut says. And if your gut says Wendy right now, you yep. stick to it. Looks like he's going to go one more game with his main. Uh, even if you pick the secondary character, you know, you're always more comfortable with the character that you started with, right? So, so thinking maybe he can get it done. Starting with a good percent lead here. Uh, Sheik just combos Bowser Jr. for days, though. And it's, it's hard to watch. I mean, Sheik combos just about every character for days. That's true. So... Koopaling, no exception. At the same time, just getting in on Sheik is going to be so difficult. Right? As you can see, Hayden is making it work. Already got K9 to 80%. Ooh, is he going to... Okay. Does not fall for the ledge trap. One of Hayden Hayden's favorites. Uh, smart to DI out there, but... Oh, the Vanish not going to take it quite yet. Okay. okay, not swinging out the hammer. That's really smart. Ooh. K9's reaction is so good that he would have actually... As soon as that hammer connected onto his shield, it would have been a back air right on that Koopa. Yeah, I'm actually surprised Hanenator didn't get the kill right there. He got K9 with the hit that he wanted out of the uh, the Koopa cart, but uh, did not was not able to convert, and K9 will take this first stock of game two. Looking like pre patch for that down throw. Yeah, <laughs> really. <laughs> Throws out the Mecha Koopa. That Mecha Koopa, I've seen, uh, seen Hanenator do some interesting things with that. Uh, it has wonky interactions with a lot of other items. Oh, he wow. caught, catches him on the backswing of the bouncing fish. Oh, very unfortunate for Terranary. He got the trap of the ledge with his uh, with his uh, Koopa cart exploding. Only the first hit actually connecting on a canine, though. Dash attack sending Terranary off stage. Oh, my God, the weak hit Nair again, just like you were talking about earlier. That Nair just ruining it. So Bowser Jr. Disgusting. Or, excuse me, Windy. Windy. Just any long-lasting hitbox. Especially if it's like a soft hit in there, it's going to allow K9 to just follow up. But drop down up there is the answer for the first stock. Was he trying to uh, grab the Mecha Koopa right there with Jab, but it just like walked past him for no reason? <laughs> that was pretty good. I mean, some people think that the Mecha Koopa has a mind of its own. <laughs> I would not, uh, not disagree with that. So, oh, uh, K9 is definitely going for the 50 50 right here. Ooh, yep. Tatanator does not air dodge. You gotta listen for that audio cue when Sheik does the bouncing fish. That's that's your clue if if you're gonna get hit or not, and you gotta react to it. That's the idea. Those throws correctly. Yeah, exactly. Should not be getting a a bouncing fish follow up that easily. No, that was a very high percent for that bouncing fish to actually uh, be true. Yeah. If you want to see Tater Nader and Wendy make it that much further, you need to give Tater Nader your power because uh, he's looking a little drained right now. Yeah, he, he kind of spent it all against Zenyu, it looks like. But, I mean, you know, don't maybe... Don't get me wrong. That's a good, that's a good player. Yeah, I mean, if, if you got <laughs> if you got to burn it, yeah. <laughs> burn it on Zenyu. Uh, s decides he will go to Game 3 with the Bowser Jr. Going to Final Destination this time, though. Uh, I know he generally likes 
town a lot. Uh, but after the last two games where he died off the top a couple times, it did not seem. Oh no! When you when you can't pick up your own item, man, that you know it's you know it's not going well. Not only that, but he's he's landing with these unsafe uh, options and throwing out fair. Has a good amount of lag recovery, and Canine just following up off of it. But you know what? Let's see if he can find a new gear in that Mecha Koopa, man. Let's see if he can kick it into overdrive. Not looking good so far, but you know, I'll, I'll, I'll keep the belief going for now. Ooh, that was pretty cute by Canine right there. I kind of wanted to see it hit. <laughs> very, no surprise to see that uh, all our Sheik's very adept at going for that mix up with the bouncing fish off the wall. And gets the same. Same mix-up again. Does not change what he was doing at all. It's just working. But you didn't use the, uh, the Mecha Koopa to land safely. But just throwing out a barrage of attacks. Canine making it very difficult just to land his feet on the ground. Taternator dropping first stock. Dig deep now, Taternator, if you want to take this one. But Canine with a commanding lead right now. Only 48%. Game three. Taternator potentially on his tournament stock at this point. That's right. Getting stuck on the right side of the stage. K9. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, it looked like he traded with down air. That was yeah, he traded with down air. That was a very strange interaction there. The clock. Oh, 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 okay. Wow, the vanish. K9 holding down, making sure that he doesn't grab the ledge right away. Uh, letting the wind box and the hurt box come out and interrupt the down air from Taternator. That would have been uh, bad news for K9. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, doesn't get the second one. I see him get the people with the backswing quite a lot. Uh, kind of surprising to see. Oh, okay, he did get the card back. And gets the kill and makes it back. That was... I did not think he had the distance. Swing for the fences, he did. Uh, oh, not yet. A little too late. Wendy is a thick girl, man. <laughs> get the one needle, but no bouncing fish conversion. Oh, again? Stuffs the bouncing fish with the forward air. That forward air, uh, it actually has a... It stuffs a lot of moves. You'd be surprised. It lasts a, a lot longer than people would expect for a Yeah, forward it does. Air. It has that weird landing hitbox yeah. that you'll sometimes see, too. Catches a lot of people off guard. And it spins... Uh, it doesn't just spin around once. Is he going to get it? Oh. Hard explosion. That's yeah. a great trap for Tater and oh. Bouncing fish right over the F-Smash. Oh, but Bear. across the stage, not quite going to get it. Okay, I see Tater Nair's Nothing here is true. Oh, no. Does not air dodge the forward air. And uh, K9 will take it 3-0. He's got to learn to DI that forward throw. It's, it's true. It's, it's true. really messing with Tater. You should not be able to follow up.